Hey guys, I'm here to share with you real quick um, my finished pin cushion. And I had shown you guys um, this before. It wasn't all the way done in a recent video. And I finally um, got to finish it up today and I needed to get this in the mail. So I wanted to make sure I was able to share the finished project with you guys. And I do apologize. Um, I've been working on a couple projects and I have gesso all over me. But I really needed to get this done because I wanted to share with you guys before I send it out. So, um, sorry about my hands. <laughs> See, I got gesso all over. So if you recall in the other video I showed you guys, um, I had all this part done. So what I decided to do, just to do it simple, and I used one of these really pretty... Um, it's like a light pink button. It's from Michaels. And then, um, so I wanted to do like a light yellow and a light pink um, color theme for this because the person that is going to be receiving this likes yellow. And um, I just thought the color combination was cute. So I decided to go with that. Um, so I did these stick pins earlier this morning. And so, um, as you can see, there's just a variety. I used some floral pins in the background here. This is a Wild Ochre Craft pin, and these are just two little corsage pins. So, um, I just used, I went through my stash and looked for um, yellow, which I don't really have very much yellow. I'm not surprised because I don't really use it a lot. So, I did find some, so I used them. And I have pink because you guys know I like to work with pink. So um, these are the stick pins that I made for it. This one. You guys know I love my stick pins. I love making pin cushions. So um, I was able to do it pretty quick. So um, those are the pins that I made for it. And um, I did show you guys in the last video, but basically what I did was this is one of my cat food can pin cushions and you guys know that I like to recycle things whenever possible so um, I save some of my cat food cans um, I, of course I clean them very well and um, I like to make pin cushions out of them because they're like the perfect size and plus it's always nice to save something from going in the trash and so what I did was I had covered it in this yellow paper went over it with this lace at the bottom and then the slice at the top and then I just used this yellow trim right here that's from Michaels and some white flatback pearls all the way around and then at the bottom I just put some yellow cardstock and then some fancy trim around it just to give it um, a nice clean edge and finish it off and then I just stamped it with the handmade by stamp that um, I got recently from Michaels and then um, yeah that's it you guys so I hope the person that gets it likes it um, let me know what you guys think. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye.